Fernando, how's your day going? Aside from talking to tons and tons of media people asking the same questions. I'm 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 doing very well there. And thank you so much. Is that an avocado floating behind you? <laughs> I took this balloon from an avocado from Mexico press event. And I thought it was going to last two days. And like six months later, it's still inflated. What do you do with it? I think Broke I think out. you were worried, you know, avocado spoils easily, but apparently not. <laughs> apparently not. But hey, congratulations on this series. Now, how many different names does it have around the world? Because in some countries, it's women in blue. Uh, other countries, it's Las Azulas. Is there a French name, a, J a Japanese name, et cetera? I, I would I would I don't know. I think part of part of me says I would hope so, because then I'd love to collect all these names and put all these posters up on my wall. But another then, then I, 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 I also would like I mean, if I had a choice, which I yeah. don't for, I didn't this matter. But I think I think it should be called Las Azules everywhere. Works for me. I understand what that means. So right, exactly. Uh, for you, is there any background in law enforcement or family? Because you've been successfully making stuff since your early 20s. That much I know. Yeah. Well, no, I don't have any background on that. But I, I do, however, uh, have two teenage girls. And I am the son of a woman who raised five kids by herself and and worked her ass off. Sorry. Uh, and and she, you know, and it's, and it's sort of when I heard about the first female police department, I immediately thought, you know, in many ways, and I heard about this entire story, I thought, I thought that's incredible that in some ways we've made so much progress since 1971 to the yeah. point where now we have a female president coming in soon in Mexico City, we're in Mexico. Um, and not only that, it's the first election that my daughter was able to vote in and, and her two choices were two women. And, and and it was a it was a it was an election between two women for for a country that I always thought was, you know, it, it was a long way to go until a woman would would be president. And so in that sense, I'm I think that there's a definite through line between the Azules and and the woman in the presidency. And at the other end, I think that the serial killer that we represent in the show is a sort of a representation of the of the countless, countless murders of women in, in Mexico in 2024, you know, where 10 women a day are murdered for being women. Um, and, and I think that in that sense, it's heartbreaking to see how far away we are from what I what, what anybody could consider, you know, um, a, a good, a good progress. Well, as you're saying here, the good keeps getting better, the worst keeps getting worse, and that's the state of the world. So my last question before I let you go, uh, what is your correct job title? And I ask that because you are the showrunner of this show, yes. but you're a director, but you're a writer, but you're a producer. Do you have an easy way to describe what you do? I mean, also studio head, too. Yeah, I think I think that, um, I think my best job title would be control freak. Um, but, but I, but I absolutely, I think showrunner is what describe, what would describe me the best. Got it. And, uh, in closing, uh, more excitement to come. This is not the last project you're working on, correct? More from Lemon Studios in the future? Absolutely. Actually, well, I just directed a few episodes of, a of a beautiful Chris Brancato show called Hotel Cocaine. Um, and that's out. My two episodes are out. I directed episode three and four. And I'm I'm writing some more stuff. I mean, my priority right now is the Azules. So if the show does does well, uh, starting July 20, 20, uh, July thirty first on Apple TV Plus, if it does well as as well as I think it's going to do, then I'll have I'll have a job for another year or so. <laughs> Looking forward to all that. Thank you for your time and congrats on Las Azules getting the great reviews it's getting. Thank you so much. Outro cast.